Hey guys, welcome back. Hope you're doing well, staying safe, taking care of yourselves, all those kind of things. And today we're talking about the Black Friday specials that my friends over at Skyloom have just announced. They start today. They run through November 29th. I'm going to get into those in just a moment. But first, I have three very quick and easy favors to ask of you. I don't ask for a lot of favors. I just like to sit here and make videos. But in this case, I have a couple of favors. The first one is if you purchase anything from them, if you'd consider using my link, I'd greatly appreciate that. It is an affiliate link. They credit me with a, a referral commission. If you use it, it doesn't cost you anything extra. And of course, it provides me some support, which is great. And I super very much appreciate it because I'll be here every week making videos about this stuff. Anyway, favor number one. Favor number two is if you're interested in all the news that's coming around Luminar Neo, please hit subscribe to this channel down below. I'm going to be making a lot of videos. I'll be putting them out every week. I would love it if you subscribed. And favor number three, if you also are interested in my email newsletter that I send out from my website about once a month, except when there's a lot of news and there's a lot of news coming, I'll send it out a little bit more frequently. But there's a subscribe link to that down below. You also get a few freebies, a couple of LUTs, a couple of free sky overlays, things like that. Anyway, that link is down below. That's it for my asks. I am here to give, and I'm going to give you some info about Skyland Black Friday deals. Let's hit it, my friends. Starts today, runs through November 29th. There's a number of different uh, bundles here, as you can see. I won't bore you to death or insult you by reading it to you. I just want to point out these are some pretty darn good prices. Um, by the way, when it says one seat, that means you can install it on one computer. If it says two seats, you can install it on two computers. That's what the difference is. I get that question sometimes. If you have any of their previous apps, $49 for one copy of Neo, which is coming out this winter. I don't have a final date yet, but keep in mind, as it says here, you get a 30-day money-back guarantee from the date of delivery. So you can buy today, risk-free, get it whenever you get it, and then 30 days you have from the day you get it to decide if you want to keep it. I think that's a great deal. Um, if you're a new user and don't own, own any of their products for $59, you can get a copy of Luminar Neo Reserved. And I'm particularly excited about some of these bundles. Like if you look at the bottom, there's some with the Sky Pack, there's some with the Roar HDR, and I haven't forgotten about a Roar HDR. I've got two more videos uh, already made coming really soon about Luminar AI, plus a video I made about a Roar HDR. So I continue to talk about all these products. I'm going to add Luminar Neo into the mix. But the price for Aurora HDR is something like 99 bucks, And so for uh, $69 for a one-seat license, you can reserve a copy of Luminar Neo and get Aurora HDR. It's basically like they're paying you 30 bucks to get Neo uh, or something. So anyway, super great deals. That's, uh, that's what's on offer. And again, those links are down below. But I want to show you some of the new visuals that they just sent out because there's some really cool and interesting stuff coming. I want to talk about it here for a couple of minutes. If, if you weren't clear on what NEO is, it's kind of like Luminar 4 plus Luminar AI smushed together and turned into a pro package. On the left, here's all the stuff that's in Luminar AI. There's like eight or 10 AI tools, and then there's a bunch more stuff coming. But I want to dig into a couple of things real quick because they shared some new visuals with us. This is an example of layers and how it's going to work. This is not a screenshot from the app. This is just a visual, right? So I just wanted to point that out. But if you look on the left-hand side, you can see there's three different pieces here. There's uh, that piece, which appears to have the hut, which is right there. There's that piece, which has the sky. And then there's that piece, which has some other stuff in it. Um, I'm not even sure what that is relative to the final image. But if you look at the final image on the right-hand side, new sky. I think these birds were added. Those huts were added. There's some light leak kind of overlay. The point is layers capability is built in. It's going to be super fun and amazing and powerful. Here's another example where they've used basically some rock as a bit of a frame, uh, right, as an overlay. And so remember, overlays are included, and there's going to be a number of overlays built into the app. So I think we're going to have a lot of power, a lot of flexibility for doing some fun creative, interesting things, even composite kind of things like in these photos. Now, what I wanted to jump into here is this is Relight AI. I don't know if this is what it's really going to look like, but these are different visuals than we've had before with different sliders. I wanted to point that out because if you look at my previous Neo videos, this is different stuff. So if you look at it, brightness near and brightness far. So how bright do you want the near part of the photo versus the far part of the photo, right? And the depth is going to allow you to adjust the difference between near and far and kind of slide that um, up or down the photo, right? And so that's what I'm feeling this is going to work like. By the way, I'll have more detailed information on this really soon. Another reason I asked you to subscribe if you'd like to follow along with these things. 
But the cool thing is they've also got a slider for the warmth from near or far. So you can separately not just move the light from near and far sections of the photo and adjust where that line is between near and far, but you can also adjust temperature there. I think that's really cool. That's gonna come in super handy. Here's another example. If you look here, you can see that in the background, they've added a little bit of darkness. In the foreground, they've added a little bit of brightness, also brighten the faces. Just powerful, fun stuff. I think this Relight AI tool is gonna to be awesome. A couple of new visuals on dust spots and power lines. I wanted to point this out because as I said in that last video, I suspect that, or suspected at the time, that removing power lines and removing dust spots was gonna be part of the erase function. And it looks like they're gonna have it as a submenu within erase. Again, don't know if this is final, but that's what it looks like it's gonna do. So it looks like one click and take out the power lines, or in this uh, photo example, dust spots. Take it out, boom, they're gone. And then if you need to go refine something, you go back to erase and refine it. The thing I wanted to point out is there's all these little things here that could be confused as dust spots, like these little trees and whatever, you know, bushes that are here in the photo. It didn't take those out. So I think it looks like it's really using a lot of intelligence there to help us get accurate results. And I thought this was a great one for power lines. Same kind of thing. You get this same visual where it's a single click button within the erase function, but you do that and it takes it out. And the nice thing is this power line here is intersecting that antenna. But if you look at the antenna, I think that looks really good. Not even to mention all the power lines down here across the building and the cables running along the side of that building. That just looks fantastic. So I'm really excited to try that out. That's it for the new visuals. Just wanted to talk about the Black Friday specials and show you the new visuals for relight and dust spot removal and power line removal. I'm gonna have more info soon. Stay tuned, subscribe if you haven't. And thanks for watching my friends. I'll be back really soon. Appreciate you guys watching, appreciate the support. I'll catch you in the next video. And until then, you guys take care of yourselves and adios.